Well, today in Chattanooga, local veteran and Medal of Honor recipient Larry Taylor was laid to rest. A private memorial service was held at the Coolidge National Medal of Honor Heritage Center. Afterwards, the funeral procession began near the aquarium and headed down Market Street. Those who wanted to pay their respects for Captain Taylor lined the streets of downtown Chattanooga. And Taylor was not only a leader, but also a friend and mentor to countless comrades who had the distinct privilege of serving with him, alongside him, in the air and those of us who fought beneath him on the ground. Those watching the procession were even waving their own American flags. It then ended at the Chattanooga National Cemetery. And when that process reached the National Cemetery, Captain Taylor was given an internment ceremony. News 12's Nick Hill witnessed the ceremony as our American hero has reached his final resting place. Back in September, Captain Larry Taylor of Signal Mountain received the highest honor you can in the United States for his brave actions to save four soldiers in Vietnam. Today, that sacrifice was at the forefront of those remembering him. Larry. They tell me your next mission is going to be solo. It's to heaven's gate. I won't be your co-pilot on this one, Larry, but I'll follow you up if the good Lord gives me the same follow-on mission. Godspeed, sir. Captain Taylor's final send-off had to be perfect for the decorated Chattanooga. As a Chattanooga, I'm, I'm, I could be prouder to turn out on the streets uh, from business people, uh, walking up down handing out American flags. Captain Taylor was honored with a 21 gun salute, oh. Army Apache helicopter flyover, and the playing of taps. Many dignitaries were present at the ceremony, including the lone surviving soldier who Captain Taylor saved that faithful night in Vietnam, Dave Hill. Dave, your presence is the ultimate tribute to Larry and to his valor. As we know, without Larry, your service would have been held a long time ago. At a celebration for the Medal of Honor back in September, Captain Taylor recalled what the honor meant to him. However, he said the meaning went beyond any award he could have received. You realize that those people on the ground are your brothers. If you have been on the other foot, they would stop for you. Captain Taylor's story of heroism will continue to outlive him. Just because you're told to do something, sometimes the harder right is easier to do than the, 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 the easier wrong. It could easily return to base, filled up, come back, nobody would have questioned him. But he knew that if he did, if he went back to base, those four rangers down there would likely be not be killed. Captain Larry Taylor will be laid to rest next to fellow Medal of Honor recipients Charlie Coolidge and Desmond Doss. We at News 12 would like to extend our condolences to the Taylor family and friends at this difficult time. Reporting from the Chattanooga National Cemetery, Nick Hill, News 12.